welcome to our youtube channel so today i am going to explain how to copy highlighted cells to one sheet to another so here i will show you how we can copy using uh, highlighted text especially here uh, i highlight i have highlighted uh, some of my uh, table data using yellow color and red color so I want to copy red colored and yellow colored cell to sheet 2 and sheet 3 using VBA code. So that is what I use to do this. So I think this will help to you when you uh, work with Microsoft Excel. So especially here I use small symbol VBA code to copy highlighted cell to from sheet 1 to sheet 2 and sheet 3 so uh, before go to the video do not forget to subscribe our youtube channel for more videos like this and also i will include the code i use for this project in my blog site so i'll add uh, my blog link under my video description so you can easily uh, take uh, the codes i use for this project so this is my uh, new excel sheet here i have some uh, pre-entered excel table with these details so firstly i'll show you i'll copy my data to this new workbook like this So these are the sample data used to uh, explain the process. So here you can see I have colored some cells in yellow color and also I have colored some cells in uh, red color and the A1 cell range A, A to uh, D1 A1 to D1 cell range is, uh, is the heading of my sheet. So I want to copy yellow colored cells to sheet 2 the red color sheet to sheet 3 so therefore firstly i want to add another sheet and it is sheet 2 and i'll add another sheet sheet 3 now i have all together three sheets so sheet 1 contains the contains the my data and i want to copy my uh, yellow colored items sheet 2 and the red colored items to sheet 3 so before doing this i want to save my excel workbook as macro enabled workbook so go to save as then select a desired location here i use just say desktop Then here, save as type. You have to select X-ray Excel macro enabled workbook. So that is what you have to select. So after selecting the save as type and the uh, after you given uh, desired name, then you have to click save. Yes, my workbook is saved now. Now I have uh, pre-written. I have pre-written VBA code. So I don't want to waste my time by writing calls here and also I don't want to waste your time by writing uh, calls now. So I have pre-designed code, pre-written code, PBA code. So let's see. So I have copied my uh, codes here. No, not bad. So this is the code I used to uh, copy uh, yellow rose, yellow rose to sheet 2. So I'll copy my code, copy, then what should I do, I, you have to click on the developer tab, so under the developer tab you can see here, the first one, the visual base, so select the developer tab and click on the visual base.
to do this click on the developer tab so once you click on the developer tab you can see visual basic you see visual basic at the very first beginning so click on the visual basic so once you click on the visual basic you can see uh, this kind of window here i select this workbook so then what i want to do i want to copy this code set code block it is for copy yellow cells rows okay copy yellow rows this is the coding for copy yellow rows so i am going to copy this code then i am going to paste here like this you can see here my uh, source sheet is sheet 1 it's clear this is my source sheet so it is the this is the sheet 1 and uh, my target sheet it means the where i want to copy my yellow colored cells is a uh, is a target sheet so it is sheet 2 so i have uh, added sheet 2 for my workbook it's clear then i want to what i want to do i want to copy yellow color rows to sheet 2 so this is the rgb color for yellow so you have to give this rgb this is the color code for the yellow color interior color then These are the basic things includes in this code. So after copying to sheet two, then it will pop up a message: "Yellow rows copy successful." So there. So this is for the copying yellow cells, yellow rows. On the other hand, I want to copy the red color rows too. So to do this, this is this is to my second code block: copy red rows. So I am going to copy this one. like this copy then i am going to paste here yeah paste then now i have copy red rows and copy yellow rows here what what is the sort sheet the sort sheet is same this sheet one this is the we are sheet we are my uh, data contains all data contains and the target sheet is the sheet we are the red color rosa copy so they are sheet tree i have added sheet tree already i have added sheet tree for this purpose right and this is the rgb color sets for red color and this is for the white you see so likewise now i want to save this one then i want to uh, run this code via a macro macro option now uh, save Now I want to uh, move to my Excel workbook again. Yes, let's try. Now I am in sheet one. So I to run this code. What you should do is again go to developer tab. Then after Visual Basic, you can see option called Macros. Click on the Macros. Then you see you you can see your codes here. This workbook dot copy yellow rows. Okay, to copy yellow rows, you should What to do? What you should do is just select this one and press run. Yes, once it successfully uh, copied yellow rows to the sheet two, then it gives a message: yellow rows copied successfully. Let's go to the sheet two and see. Here you can see my uh, yellow colored cells. Yellow colored rows are copied successfully from sheet one to sheet two. So my next target is to copy red color cells from sheet one to sheet three. So to do this again, go to developer tab and click on the macros. Then you have a command macro command. This workbook dot copy rows. Just select by default is selected. However, so then what you should do is just click on the run button. So once you click on the run button, red rows copied successful message comes. Press OK. Then let's go to the sheet three. Yes, you can see your red colors copies. Yeah, yeah, red color. You can see your red color rows are copied successfully. Now you can see sheet two contains yellow rows and the red sheet three contains yellow red one. So likewise, you can copy highlighted cells in different colors. To different sheets by using this code. Okay. 
or do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this. On the other hand, if you want to get the codes, relevant codes for this uh, project, I'll include them in my blog site so you can see my blog link on the video description and please share this video and don't forget to my uh, YouTube channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching. So let's meet with another video. Thank you.